Now, Yen Li had missed her sister by moments only, for this was the real Hu San Yang. Morning to you. I'd like some food, please. With pleasure. I can't take a joke. Let me out. I'll have to free myself. I'll get out of here and... and I'll smash you into pieces. All right, then. Well, uh, well, uh, Bing Chung, you said so. You're a good man. At this moment, I'm going there. So take me oh, with you. No, you don't. You're a bit familiar, you are. If you can't protect a defenseless maid like me, they'll never have you at Liang Shampo. You think? I do. He's come here to see you. Lin Chung, it's you. Wu Song. It's you. Wu Song. I didn't ever think to see you again, brother. You're alive. I've come to join you. If you'll have me. Lin Chung, it's you. It's you. Stop that, you. You. Lin Chung. I'm someone with me. Lin Chu himself. I am the younger sister of Hu San Yang, and I'm looking for Are you. Where is my sister, please? She's not here. No women are here. They told me she'd come here to you because of her feeling for you. Huh? You're not. You're Hu San Yang's little sister? You should have said so earlier, Yen Lai. I've just seen her over at the inn at Chicha. Oh? Yes. And but for her, I'd not be here now. I know she'll come here to you. Please let me wait for her. I'll find some way that I can be of use. That's impossible. There are no women here. Rules say no. I am Wan Lung. Lin Chung, I have something for you to do. Su Chu has a wholesaler of medicines, an evil one who is cheating the sick at Kao Chu's secret behest. Will you prevent this? Wu Sung? If you prove yourself during this action, you will be allowed to stay here. The decision is Lin Chung's. You, girl. Lin Chung must take you when he goes. Tell me your story on the way. Wu Sung, let's go. Oh, couldn't we eat something first? Excuse me. <laughs> Go with God. Don't you feel sorry for her? 
Oh, Taishung's coming. Linchung, bad news. Su Chu city has been sacked already by the bandits of the mountain. Sacked? There's one thing you can do. Show them your metal. How? Attack their stronghold. What an idea. You're forgetting that Chu Wu's our brother. Huh? Brother? No brother of mine, that outlaw. Something else. How can you join us if you don't win today? Ah. Ah. Are you in agreement? Yes. Go there. Meet. I have an idea. Hey, we got rich from that ah, sailor. Oh, you say too much. Well, you said you wanted to meet her. <laughs> well, then behave. Oh, yes, sir. I know I can't compete with your beauty. Oh. With my brain. Insolence! <laughs> Increased taxes caused starvation, led people to flee for their lives. Some fled to the law, but with a magistrate like Ho, this was like having as a shepherd a hungry wolf. Magistrate Ho says the emperor is ashamed of you all, and he has ordered you a beating. Hey, Mo. You! Who are you? Get out of the way! Right! And you, I take it, are the, uh, the chief instigator. I am the instigator of my own affairs. The petal dragon? It's Shi Qin. Put down the chair. Why, Shi Jin, do you hinder a magistrate? If you really are some sort of magistrate, I was attacked in the street. In penance to you, my Shi Jin, tell me how may I make amends? Make a... No apology is enough. So come to my house with me to die. Ah, uh, then I'd... I'd be satisfied. So does love make you that crazy? Oh, always. Oh, love, love, love. Hey, Liang Shan Po! I wonder if it's our loot they're after. <laughs> right? Well, let them fight for it. Ah! Shan Po. The rest you will soon hear. I'm on a mission to get you all to come to Lian Shan Po. With Liang Shan Po? Me? What could be better when you have Lu Ta and Shi Jin? We will ride together. Ah, Chu Wu, why don't you? Oh, wouldn't it be good? Say yes to Lin Chung. Come with us. Lu Ta, Shi Jin, and all of you. 
I can't decide alone. The others must be us. And Utah's gone off. Gone where? Who knows with Utah? Somewhere the drink will never run dry, and the women always say yes. <laughs> he Chin? He also went rushing off after love to rescue some damned woman somewhere. He went alone? Yes. Tattoo dragon, drink a hell. If it won't offend you, I'll exchange our cups. <laughs> Chi Chin is an outlaw, so you will arrest him. I know you came here hoping to rescue your lady love. Then please fetch her here now. All right, then. <laughs> 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 See how long he lives, eyeless and limbless. And when he's dead, you and I will go to the capital where Kao Chu will give us all the luxury you can think of. Yes, my dear. <laughs> Running faster than an arrow's flight, never resting, Tai Tsung brought news of Xi Qin's capture to Lin Chung at Liang Shan Po. He must be rescued, and I must forbid you to try it. Commander, I ask you to let me do this. Or what are we here for? I thought we must fight oppression everywhere. Of course, that's true. So be it then, Commander. I've got to try to rescue Shi Chin. And I will. I forbid you to attempt it. We can't afford to lose so many men. Shi Chin brought this on himself. Whose castle is impregnable, and I utterly forbid these useless deaths. Well then. Old Wu Sung's here, and I'm not one of your men. <laughs> I'll get him out. Wait. Wang Long, I promise you, I can rescue Xi without losing even one man, so how could you object? Wu Sung. Oh. Tai Sung. Thank you, friend. Ten Long. Oh, Du Shen. Honored. It is truly said, if heaven wants to reign, or your mother to marry again, nothing can prevent it. So, a sister fated to find a sister may have her prayers answered, however busy the gods of love. Help me, please. Oh, heavenly powers, to find Hu Sanyang. I beg of you. <laughs> 